get about five hundred. But first, we just saw her shine bright on the oh, red carpet yeah. at the premiere of Greatest Days. And it's nearly time for us to talk to the lovely Ashlyn B. Someone didn't get home last night. <laughs> but first, let's take a look at her in action. Big fan, eh, Rachel? Rachel, are you still... I'm their biggest fan of the whole entire world, Steve. Good. That's lucky. And uh, do you know who you're going to take with you to see the boys? Uh, uh, well, there's a couple of weeks. You've got time to make a few friends. <laughs> but in the meantime, let's play you a song that'll get you ready for what's to come by taking you all the way back to 1993. <laughs> oh. oh, and Ashley B. Straight, literally straight from last night's red carpet joins absolute us. Absolute legend. No. You're absolutely, you absolutely are. How, I mean, how was it last night? Was it I good? mean, I've just been... Sorry, but I'm in front of my brave and fearless leader, Alison Hammond. I'm absolutely <laughs> obsessed. You don't understand. Someday I thought this would be someone else's dream, but now it's finally mine. <laughs> and he touched my hand. I can't, I'm so... This is exactly it's what you need to hang over. You're hilarious. It's Hammond. everything you think I'm it's going to be more. I'm to touch your hand, if I'm honest with you. Oh, Honestly. I love I loved this film. Someone oh, sent me a you? screening. Oh. And I wasn't I didn't know what to expect. And obviously I love to take that. Yeah, 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 yeah. Watch the movie. It's all about the fans. I was in, babes. Yeah. I was in the movie. It's such a feel-good movie. When you first yeah. read it, was you like, I gotta do this? Well, it's like a get up on your feet type of thing. And I hope I hope there's some cinemas where people do get up on their feet and start singing. Like just, you know, throw away caution and start to ruin the film for everyone else by <laughs> getting up and singing. It is a sort of like summer feel-good hit. It's about um, a group of friends, as you say. It's not actually about take that. It's kind of like the way Mamma Mia isn't about ABBA. Yeah. This is using the music as a vehicle to tell the story of five friends. And I think Take That really wanted to do so. They are so passionate about their fans. They love them, they talk about them all the time. There's that documentary on ITVX that they've made, and it's so fan driven. But well, they wouldn't be here if it wasn't for the fans, would they? Yeah, I know, but you know, it's, I mean, I suppose they're kids. Like a lot of those boy bands are kids when they get into those things. And it can be uncomfortable, I can imagine, at times. And so, you, you know, you, there's a disconnect between how much they love you and how much you know about them. Yeah. They seem to really, really care I about I think them. the fact that they came back and they were so successful when they came back. Yeah, they came the back reunion, like, you're dead And they dead came back right. with, like, great stuff. Yeah, yeah. So yeah. now when you go and see a Take That concert, you're not going to see all those hits from the night, just those hits from the 90s yeah, in a yeah, purely yeah. nostalgic way. You're seeing a, a brand that's still stuff, living like and breathing, you know? And all those exactly. Yeah. And I, all do, the world I do and all miss that. Robbie, though. I do wish Robbie had come back. Like, when they all came back. Even I just as a ghost or something. Yeah, like yeah, yeah, <laughs> as, yeah, as a ghost. <laughs> yeah, that could Take be an edit at the end. Well, they could do AI now. Yes, you know, they, could. they could. superimpose him. They could have him as a hologram. But I thought, because it's based on a stage show, is that right? It's based on a West End uh, like, stage like, show, and some of the actors who were on the West End hit were there last night as well. Because it's like, really oh, clever the yeah. way they never mention Take That. The, the band are always called They're the called boys. the boys. Yeah. And I think so, there's like, as, as you saw it in that clip where they sort of like the ghost of these lads kind of tumbles so forward. Good. It's it's a beautiful device in that they're used as a, an escape, which I think is what a lot of young people use music as, as a way of putting yeah. a sort of um, explanation of your yeah. feelings and what you're going through. Completely. And the, 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 the boys is, is a device used as a sort of ex escape for a my character when I'm younger of what is going on at home. And, and that's what I loved about yeah. it. That was one of the moments. There's a moment where... I know Lara McDonald plays your your yes, so who yeah, looks she's exactly brilliant. like you. She's like your mini twin. Yeah. I thought are they CGI? No, no he said like it's unbelievable. Amazing, isn't it? the, it's so uncanny the the look of you both together. My mother saw uh, Lara in Belfast. Uh, not in the town of Belfast. <laughs> she was just, just, she's just out shopping one day and she saw her. Um, uh, she saw her in the movie Belfast and she was so good and so funny. And yeah. she was like, she should play a young you, Ashley. I'm like, Mommy, that's not how it works. Your mother can't just ring up. And it turns out then, as soon as I suggest so Your mum so, now thinks she can pick... Well, oh, she yeah, she's like, I think you should do a Star Wars next. OK, Mommy, I'll just give them a buzz then. <laughs> Um, but yeah, uh, she said I should play her, and it's funny. Well, like when I was Lara's age, they wanted to get a likeness from an old picture. But I was mahogany orange with bleach blonde hair <laughs> that like was like if you put a lighter near it, it would go up in flames. And I, and Lara looks more like I should have naturally looked that's when great. I was sixteen. So my yeah. mother was like, oh, that's what my baby could have looked like, really. <laughs> She only left herself alone and stopped plucking her eyebrows. Was so, your mother at the uh, premiere last night? No, she wasn't. We oh. FaceTimed her. Is that because, because Lara was there, so you didn't want to cause well, an awkward Yeah, seat. she might have took the wrong child. <laughs> <laughs>
<laughs> you sing as well. I didn't yes. know you. You're, I mean, I knew you could sing, but uh, I, every Irish person has a bit of a song in them. You know yourself. At least, at least three or four. Yeah, but you didn't let rip though, did you? Because you had to sing in character, so obviously she wasn't as good as. Actually I do. know because you have to make sure. Does your character know how to sing? Yeah. And when when I was uh, doing the song, I sing patience towards the end of the film. Spoiler alert! And um, <laughs> no, when I'm I was watch singing, the song now. oh no, now I know everything that happens. <laughs> um, patience comes up, um, uh, and so when I was doing it, I, I got COVID just before we started filming it, and the musical department on this were incredible, and they sort of trained my lungs back to be able to no sing. No oh, wow! And we, but we we I filmed a, a, a little clip to kind of show with them I was like oh this is how I think I'm gonna be able to do patience we dropped it a couple of notes lower and they're like oh it's quite Irish isn't it because I was giving it the full Dolores <laughs> yeah, like hi, 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 hi. you know that sort of like patience um uh, so yeah I think I, I went Ashley, who were your who were your uh, big bands in the 90s when you were growing up Spice Girls me too. Yeah, yeah, Which yeah. Which Spice yeah, Girl yeah. are you? Are you posh Spice? Um, uh, oh, thank you. Uh, but definitely not. <laughs> um, I I feel like I was a sort of Jerry Melby mix. Oh, nice. 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 You know, like a Good sort of hybrid. combo. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah I was yeah, just yeah. Melby. Melby all the way. Melby all the way. And Who was you? <laughs> was a little bit of baby and a little bit <laughs> oh. sporty. Now then, uh, <laughs> you can now relax. This is your last bit of promo. Go home, clean the house. I can uh, relax. All the babe. stuff you want to do and yeah. relax. Greatest day out in cinema Thanks, today. Dermot. Congratulations to you. It's so lovely to meet you. And Thank all that's sailing you. <laughs> and can I say you're so cute when you dance, Dermot, when you did your little dance. Ah, you you stop. With it like, oh, I need to slip. I don't think it's cute. <laughs> Love it. Can you, re can you replace the away. word cute with the word sexy and then we're yeah. kind of there? Uh, you're real sexy, Dermot. Oh. Everything's no. no, real put cute sexy. Back. Put cute back. I prefer cute. Thank, thank you, Ashley. Thank you, Ashley. Oh, thank you so much. Uh, it's